How's it going everyone? Manusparta here, bringing another episode in the Pokemon TCG series. So today, as uh, my Twitch stream, gonna have a super chill standard day. I really haven't been playing standard much recently, and I just want to sit around and get just more mileage in standard, more experience, and just get better at it. Because <laughs> right now, I'm not the best standard player. So I really want that exposure, and I really want to get more experience playing standard. Also, I have some really great reasons to be playing standard right now. So, I recently hit the 500 subs video, which was awesome. So, I get 500 subs on YouTube. Uh, if you haven't already entered the competition, I'm doing a giveaway on YouTube. On my 500 subs video, literally just enter a comment. Doesn't matter the comment, you don't have to be subscribed. I'll be pulling a random comment from that at the end of June to uh, give six Sword and Shield um, booster packs from. Now, um... Part of that, well, not part of it, but in the course of that, I ended up getting sent some really cool gifts, uh, which I really wasn't expecting, so it was really, really cool to get these. Um, so, first off, I got sent the awesome Reshiram and Charizard GX deck by OP Denny a few days ago, and like I said, I've played against this deck a few times. I actually showcased it in my 500 subs video. I'm so glad I can finally actually play it. And it's a lot of fun. So I've really, really been enjoying this deck. And then the other day, I ended up getting a message from uh, Zircon X. And they sent me the Pikachu and Zekrom GX deck, which I cannot believe. I mean, now I've got my four Jirachis, which is awesome. And, you know, like Pikachu and Zekrom GX. So, um, yeah, that happened. Um, so huge shout out to Opidenny and Zircon X. Uh, Zircon X did also send... Something else that was really cool, which you'll be seeing next month um, as part of another giveaway. So yeah, next month is also going to be a very, very fun month. Um, so yeah, thanks so much OP Denny and thanks so much Zircon X, the awesome standard decks. Um, yeah, man, it's, it's it's awesome. I really wasn't expecting it. I'm really keen because it's going to help me break into standard, which is something I've really been struggling with. And then I think it was yesterday... Um, or the day before, uh, WeJ Boys ended up sending me a card I've been looking for for a very long time. And I haven't actually been able to trade for it. Uh, which was the awesome and fantastic Prism Ditto. Which, you know, goes into like every second deck out there. And I now have one. So thanks so much, WeJ Boys. That was awesome. I'll, yeah, I mean, awesome, awesome gift. So thank you so much for that. Um, we J Boys also did end up sending through a lot of shiny hats, which I'm super, super excited about. So um, I now have some very awesome, if I actually get to them, um, deck boxes and some new card sleeves as well, which is super, super cool. Um, I like my hats. So yeah, I've got some really cool deck boxes, so my standard decks can actually look legit now. So yeah, thanks so much for all the awesome gifts. I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, it really means a lot to me. I'm glad you appreciated my content and yeah, thanks so much for the little gifts. I really, really do appreciate them. So it's time to use those gifts and actually improve my standard game because I'm tired of sucking at standard and I want to get better at it. So uh, unfortunately, this isn't the best ladder to be playing on. I'm really not a fan of these prizes. Um, as I said previously, it's kind of one of those meh like cool they're there but i'm not going to use them so um this is literally my first game with pikachu and zekrom gx deck so yeah <laughs> if i don't play it perfectly i do apologize um but that's the reason i'm practicing i want to get better especially at standard i want to get better because i'm not good at it yet so i want to try and get as many games in as i can to really just practicing it better better with it. So yeah, again, if you haven't entered that competition for end of June, please do so. It's free. You're getting six boosters out of, out of it if you win. Um, so I don't see any reason not to. Ugh, bad, bad starting hand. Really bad starting hand. Um, and there was something else I wanted to say. Oh yeah, my new uh, June top 10 is out. Thanks so much for all the awesome comments. Like, I really appreciate those comments. Because, um, obviously, the feedback is really useful for me to grow as a player, uh, which I really, really appreciate. But on top of that is the fact that um, 
Mm, I don't know what I want to do with this. Um, I use those comments to build the next video. So certainly, like, call me out if you don't agree with what I did. Call me out on it. I really do appreciate it. Because, as I said, I use those comments to actually build the next one. Uh, you can play this card. Uh, you can play this card only if you discard two of the cards from your hand. Search your deck for two in any combination of Pokemon GX and Pokemon EX. Reveal them, put them into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Um, I don't really want to play that right now because I don't want to actually discard these cards. So I want to actually just put this energy down in Zapdos and pass. I actually would have, really would have liked this hand going, um, going second. Because I could have gone the Zapdos and get the, got the KO on the first turn. That would have been fun. Because um, the Cinderace, if they switch out... Ooh, they actually got their Giant Hearth out. That's a, not ideal. Um, because next turn I'm definitely going for switching to Zapdos and Marnie. And yes, I finally have Marnie. I actually really liked Marnie from the games. Um, so I'm super excited to actually have the card. Or when I say games, I meant Shield. I've only played, played Shield. Um, so I'm super excited that I finally got Marnie's. I mean, it's such an awesome, awesome card. Um, like, I can now actually use it. Oh my word, they actually got Weld off on turn one. Ugh, that's ugly. Okay, well, um... This is awkward. So I'm going to switch into Zapdos to get this free knockout. Marnie, that big hand of theirs away. Hey, Johnny, Co uh, Johnny Quest Welder. Yes, they got a very frustrating Welder off on the first turn, which I was not too happy about. Um, I don't... So, electronically, I've got a discard, right? I don't really want to discard Pikachu and Zekrom. Um, I guess I could discard Mellow and Lana. Do I need to, though? I think I actually want to be discarding energies with that, but I don't actually have that, so I might need money for the next draw. Um, and I guess let's do this. I don't know, like I said, I'm still super new with this deck, so like, there's going to be some mistakes. Um, this is legit my first game with it. Johnny Quest, how are you doing, my friend? Thanks so much for coming through for the stream. How is your weekend going? Well, I presume it's the weekend. It's weekend for me. It's Saturday morning. And I'm also very chipper because I got like four hours sleep last night. Um, so yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is not a great hand at the moment. Um, I did kind of muddle this one up. Um, reveal a Pokemon from your hand and put it into your deck. Okay. Let's do this. Let's put Picaron back in my deck. And let's bring out... Uh, I need a way to energy accelerate. I don't see a way of doing that right now. Uh, let's go for... Jirachi? Let's get Jirachi out. Let's switch into Jirachi. And let's go for the Marnie. To give myself a new hand. Okay. Draw cards with six cards in your hand, and then your turn ends. Okay, I'll definitely be using that. Recess Dump, I certainly don't want to use. Pokey, I don't want to use. Energy Switch, I don't want to use just yet. Let's drop that. I've only got one energy in there. I actually need another energy in there. Um, okay, let's hit Jirachi. Let's see what we get. Oh, man. I actually really would like that energy. Um... Okay, I guess let's cycle these because of Rotom Bike. And let's see what we get. You play this card, if you have four few other cards in your hand, draw a card for each card, each of your opponent's Pokemon play. Yeah. It's not great, but uh, at least I get one out of it. Okay, there's nothing else to do here. Tapu Coco, I'm only going to get one energy back from that, because I've only got one energy there, so that's not going to help me just yet. Recess Stamp helped my opponent. That energy switch does nothing for me, so let me Rotom Bike. And there's some energies. All right. Um, that's actually pretty good. Um, now I wish I had that electromagnetic wave thing to get rid of these two energies to charge that onto my bench Pokemon and then get going from there. Um, Johnny Quest, Friday night here in the United States. Oh, right. You stateside. I forgot about that. Um, yeah. That makes complete sense. Um, 
Yeah, so it's Friday night there. Yeah, that's the problem from streaming from Asia side. Uh, unfortunately, I'm sitting at GMT plus nine, so it's kind of like an awkward time no matter when I do it. Adding a Bolt-on V is another way Picarom accelerates energy. I think I actually have a Bolt-on V, so I'm going to double-check that, although I might have traded mine away. Um, I need to get this Picarom GX online, so I honestly think I might drop Tapu Coco. <sighs> I don't want to drop, but like, I can't afford to drop a tag team. Ah. This is frustrating. Um, reset stamp does does nothing, so it ends up being the same thing. I don't want to switch this turn, so I actually think Prof's research makes the most sense. Because I want those there. Things like now, I actually wish this wasn't there. Um, let me drop one energy there just in case. And let me Prof the sand away. I just need to get this on to the next batch of energies. Tag switch, move up two energies from one of your tag team Pokemon to another. Do I want to get Raichu online first? This Pokemon was on the bench and became the active Pokemon this turn. This tag is 18 more damage and your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Switch this Pokemon 1 to be bench Pokemon. If this Pokemon has at least two extra energies attached to it, this tag has more damage, okay? And switch your deck for up to three energies and attach them to one of your Pokemon, then shuffle your deck. If this Pokemon has at least three extra energies attached to it, in addition to the tech that has damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. So that's that's really what I want to get going on this next turn. Um, ooh, that's going to hurt, that hot burning GX. Um, so let's quick ball that away. And let's bring out another Jirachi? Or is it too late for Jirachi? Do you want to charge up my other Pikachu and Zekrom? Um, let me bring out the Jirachis. Again, like I said, I'm still really learning this deck. So I apologize if I'm making the wrong plays right now. I'm not familiar with this deck yet. I'm still getting a feel for it. Uh, let's just bring those back for reasons. And let's bring back these two. Okay. There's nothing else I can really do here. So unfortunately, I'm just going to pass. Um, I should actually use Giant Heart after Discard Energies to use Tapu Koko. Yeah, I should have actually done that. Uh, yeah, so Johnny Chris adding a bolt on V. I'm pretty sure I still have bolt on V. I can't remember if I traded it away or not. I want to say I didn't, but I genuinely can't remember. Okay, let's bring the Pikachu and Zekrom in. Uh, the problem is now, like, if they knock this out of this game, which is a huge, huge problem for me. Let's drop this there. Um... I mean, I'm not too worried about this hand, so I guess I can just get this hand away. Let's get a new hand. Um, there's Electromagnetic Wave, which I've been waiting for for how long now? Um, I guess I could air balloon that, because I can go into the next peak ROM instead. And that might be a way of doing it. Um, radar doesn't help me now, it's too late. Poke gear, let's see what we get. Nothing. Okay, let's go for the full blitz. Get some damage off. Let's bring these three in. So the problem is I'm super scared they're going to bring in the Heatran GX next turn. 5, 10, 15. Um, okay, let's charge that up. I don't know if that was the right choice. But let's see. Um, I forgot that Burning Scarf gives me damage. I had a bunch but traded them away. High trade value. Did I trade mine away? Because, like, I don't, when I look, when I was looking at Bolton, I don't remember having it having great value. Um, maybe I didn't trade it away. Honestly, I can't remember. Because the thing is, like, I wasn't planning on playing Picarom, so I might have traded it away. Um, I don't know, I'm just going to check, because I, I got thrashed this game anyway, because I made a lot of mistakes. I'm not too worried about this game anymore. Um... Yeah, I'm mean, gonna check out. Still got it. Um, cool. Well played, my friend. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. Bolton V, Bolton V. Game on. Uh, collection. I on. I think I might have actually traded it away. Coming to think of it now. Bolt. Oh no, I still have it. Oh, I got two of them. Oh, I couldn't trade them away. That's why. Okay. Cool. So let's go deck manager and let's slot those in. Um. Let us 
I just want to make a copy of it just so I've got like the fresh one. Um, all right. So let's drop that and let's drop the ambipom. And let's bring in Boltund. Let's say hello and let's say hello. Because Boltund, so take for two energy cards, attach them to your bench Pokemon anywhere you like, and this protect the damage for each energy attached to all your Pokemon. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, I can't do that. Don't add. All right. Thanks for that, Johnny Quest. I appreciate the. Um, the help there. Okay, let's use some of my new shinies. What coin do I want to use? Let's use the... Uh, which coin should I use? Which coin feels lucky for this deck? Hmm. Mm, let's use the light gold um, Zorora co coin. Because I never use it. And like I don't use that deck either. Let's give that, let's give that coin some love and let's use it. Uh, deck boxes, hmm, which deck box do I want to use? Like, wait, let me look at the card sleeves. Hmm, I'm feeling red or I'm feeling blue? I think I'm feeling, I'm feeling blue. Let's get these going. Let's go save. And your deck has at least one incomplete evolution line. What's incomplete? What's incomplete? Oh, the Electros. Yeah, but Electros comes in by itself. Sorry, I wasn't sure what that error was for. Okay, let's try this again with new Boltund. Okay, uh, that one. Let's give this a try and let's see how it goes. Um, yeah, like I really want to get the, sta the standard mileage and just to get better. I've really been struggling breaking to standard. Look, these decks are going to help a lot. Um, and, ooh, mono green. Let's see, what does Mono Green have for me today? Let's go heads. Also, I'm like dying of heat right now. Um, do I want to go first? I actually don't want to go first. I want to go second. I'm like dying of heat today because like uh, the AC broke in the apartment. Uh, let's do that. I don't like this hand. Mm. I need drawn to a switch. Mm, I don't like this hand at all. This is unfortunate. Okay. Um, yeah, my, the AC broke in our apartment. So, like, I'm dying of heat right now. Because my PC is in the corner of my room. Um, so, it's, like, me in a corner of the room with my PC at my feet. Because I've got a tiny desk. My desk is literally, like... It's just past my shoulders. Um, and then I've got the green screen thing behind me. So, I end up in this, like, three-way heat trap kind of thing. And it's absolutely terrible. And like summer is just starting, so I am not looking forward to um, later on in the year, unless I can get the AC fixed. I think it's just out of gas though, so hopefully we can get a fix soon. But the problem with everything happening in the world, no one really wants to come say hi to fix ACs. So yeah, let's see how this goes. Um, this hand is... Like, I'm gonna have to prof this hand away. I just need to get... Um, Something. No fan. Um, my fan's kind of in the in the other room for my girlfriend at the moment. Um, so I I currently don't have it. Uh, my other fan also broke this last week. I've had a really bad week in terms of like stuff in my apartment. Um, uh, wait, let's do this first. Um, yeah, so like I'm down to one fan, which my girlfriend's currently using. And, oh, you've got to be joking. My other one's a prize card. Man, that sucks. Um, so my girlfriend's using the other one. Well, my only fan, because the other one broke earlier in the week. Um, I actually need to buy one this weekend, I think. Okay. Um, didn't get a switch, which is less than ideal. Um, yeah, there's not much I can do, unfortunately. I've kind of just got to sit here. That was a bit unfortunate. So yeah, unfortunately, yeah, <laughs> I can't even use my own fan at the moment. Um, so unfortunately, I've got to go shopping tomorrow, which is not how I want to spend my Sunday. But it is what it is. Mm. This is problematic. I'm playing a little bit slower than I would have liked. Um, damn, they got this switch off. 
And I got a fresh hand from that. I need to get this... I need to get this... Uh, Raichu and Lolan Raichu out of here. I should put the energy down on it. Ah. Damn. Okay. I'm probably going to have to mine this hand away again. Like, I'd like to use Eric's hospitality, but it's just... I need to get down to four cards. I don't know how I'm going to do that. Well, I guess I could. Yeah, I guess I could. Oof, I need to charge up so quickly now, and I don't know how I'm going to do that. Pokemon on your bench, but can you act... Pokemon this turn, this takes 70 more damage. Attack's damage isn't affected by weakness. Mm, okay. I've got Pokemon Communication, right? So I um, would be happy to use Pokemon Communication to get rid of Electros, to bring on, bring out Boltund. Let's drop Boltund. Let's give Boltund the energy. Let's Vitality boost, uh, Vitality ban the Boltund because I don't know if this right to... Well, the thing is, I'm banking on getting a draw, right? So let me put that there to bank on me getting a draw. Recess stamp I don't want to do because I'm giving my, my opponent value. Let's Erica's Hospitality this. There's the switch. That is awesome. So do I want to switch into Boltund and, and like accelerate my game? Or do I want to switch into Drachy and get better draw? I've actually got decent draw because I'm going to mine next turn anyway. So let me switch into Boltund. Nothing else I want to do. So let's go for Electrify. Let's get these two going. And let's get them onto Thunderous. Oh, the Thunderous, sorry. Uh, Pikachu and Zekrom. Why Thunderous? Okay, I'm hoping my opponent doesn't have a switch. Once you can turn your Mercedes deck for up to two grass e uh, energy cards and attach them to one of your Pokemon, then shuffle your deck. Okay, um, this is a problem though. That Voltage Beat is going to destroy me. Um, mm. Oh man, I only got the Stadium out. Mm, this is awkward. Because the problem is, I'm not going to get the Zekrom online fast enough. I might have to let Jirachi go down. I might just have to let Jirachi go down. Oh, they won't... Uh, your opponent shuffles all energy from the... Oh no, are they going to Tropical Hour me? They need six energies. Can they get to six? Because they've played one already. Uh, I don't know. It doesn't have Thunder Mountain. I'm pretty sure the deck doesn't have Thunder Mountain. Uh, that's frustrating. Okay. Uh, I need to buy myself some more time. I don't actually know if I can afford some, any time. I think I, I can't actually afford myself any time. 240. That doesn't get knocked up by Woodhammer. Uh, but I'm going to get knocked up by Tropical... Wait, they can't use Tropical out GX. Okay, that's fine. Um, so I need it. I can't actually mine this hand away because I need to have uh, Mallow and Lana for next turn. Okay, I don't want to rod just yet. Jirachi I, doesn't really help going down right now. I so want a Marnie, but I can't because I need I need Mallow and Lana for next turn. Well, I guess it's just gonna be a full blitz. Let's add these three and let's charge it up. Okay, so if I can tank this turn, I'm a little worried that I won't. I don't I, I don't know what I don't think my opponent could knock me out. On this turn. Uh. Never mind. They can. They totally can. I forgot about VMAX. We just got three energies from this Pokemon. If you do this attack, there's 50 more damage for each energy card. Yeah. Ah, oh, man. That's game. I don't have an answer. I need to get more familiar with this deck. This is gonna hurt. Uh, the problem is I don't actually have anything after this, this game. Damn. 
Need to get better at playing Picarom. <sighs> okay. I'm not gonna be afraid to get this P the Pikachu and Zekrom out early to charge up. I just need to get those three energies for full blitz. I need to get full blitz going faster. Because I played the energy acceleration way too slow. Way, way, way too slow. Okay. I'm just going to scoop here because this is game. Um, one life you want to play game? Yeah, let's have a game, Johnny Quest. Uh, I'll double check. I'm pretty sure I don't have a Thunder Mountain. I'm going to double check. But I'm fairly certain I haven't opened one. No, I haven't. Okay, cool. That's all right. Uh, yeah, let's have a game, Johnny Quest. Uh, let's go standard. There we go. I've sent you the, requ uh, the request if you're keen. Um, let's see. Okay. Ooh, let's see what you're running. Uh, let's go for heads. I want to go second with this deck. Uh, not terrible, but not great. Okay, let's drop that there. Take the back one to another. Okay. Um. Oh, nice. You guys don't join a VMAX deck. Very nice. I still need Bulldog Martial Arts Dojo deck. I, I haven't got around to getting uh, Treadwell boosters for a while. So I can't need to get those going. Alright. Um. Hmm. I might just prof this first turn. Which is a bit awkward. Okay. Let's get that down there. Let's get that down there. I may as well use it. So let's drop these. Does this discard, right? Yeah, discard. Let's drop that. Let's fill up my bench. Okay. Now our bench is looking nice and healthy. Now I can prof the hand away. And... This is looking better. It's not, I don't want to rot it just yet. There's nothing else I could do. And yeah, let's go. All right, cool. Um, I'm not listening or looking at your screen. Thanks, Johnny. I appreciate that. I know you only get that when you actually like get back and watch this again. But yeah. Okay. Um, this is a bit awkward. I need a way to charge up faster. Definitely need a way to charge up faster. So I can't be coming online turn three. That's way too slow. I need to come online faster. Okay. Um, let's see. I really want a money, but like this doesn't help me right now. If I go for it. Okay. Let's get that there. Let's get this energy down there. I uh, can then go for Erica. There we go. This is looking much better. Okay. Um, uh, that doesn't really help me. So let's just go and pass the turn. Okay. From next turn, I'm online. It's taking me a little bit longer than I would have liked, but from next turn, I'm online. Um, let's see. So this Pokemon has at least three extra energies attached to it. In addition to the attack's cost, this attack does 170 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Don't apply weakness and resistance. So we'll essentially knock, hopefully, knock out the active and then hit the bench for 170. And then get a second knockout. Which will be the, essentially the better answer. Oh, let's get the switch out. Okay, I can't knock out the in, uh, in DDV. So if I do it, I'd have to do it on the Ryalu. Although I can get all oh, going to this, the damage off the Stone Jorna side. Um, but we'll see how that goes. Oh man. Well played. Alright. Um...
I'm giving my I give my opponent draw value if I use this Marnie, but I think I kind of need to. Because his hand doesn't help me. I kind of need to do it. Not great, but I do have the switches, which I'm really, really happy about, actually. So let's full blitz this. Let's get these going. I'm really scared. I don't think I'm going to get knocked out this next turn. So I think I can charge up. Uh, let's grab that. Let's see. Let's mesh it. Glad I can finally use the card. I'm so glad I finally got Marnie's. Like, jeez. This Pokemon evolved from Rally doing. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Well played. That was a really good hit. Jeez, I didn't realize Aura struck so much damage. Damn. That hurt. Okay, well, I guess Jirachi. Um. Yeah, ow. So once you can turn before you attack, if this Pokemon is on the bench, you may choose two of your benched Pokemon and attach an energy card from discard power to each of them. If you do, discard all cards of the Pokemon and put it in the last zone. Okay, I've basically got one more chance at this. Um, the problem is nothing actually gets a knockout. Yeah, I don't actually get a knockout. Which means this is a game that Lucario um, trumps me. No, no worries. Like, it's fine. Um, if the Pokemon has at least two extra energy attached to it. So the only way I can get a knockout is the Raichu and a little Raichu's GX move. So let's just go for Stellar Wish quickly just so I can have time to think. Energy switch is I think what I'm going to need to use. Um... Let's use Tapa Coco's Dance of the Ancients to charge up those two. Done. Dragon Energy uh, there and there. Or should we drag more? Okay. Reset Stamp. Uh, I can reset Stamp them. Uh, quick Ball. There's nothing in my deck that I actually need. Energy Switch. Select a basic energy card. That one. Let's put that there. Um, and I can just prof this hand away. If I need to get this Raichu and Loden Raichu online, let's prof this hand away. And not exactly what I needed. So let's ordinary rod this. Let's do both. Let's bring back the GX. And let's bring back those energies. Alright. Um, I can drop that energy down there. I can play the Jirachi just to get more value out of Rotom Bike. Pokemon Communication, the other Jirachi away. And I can bring out... Uh, the uh, let's do that. I actually should put that energy on Boltund. Because I could have then charged up there. That was actually a mistake of mine. That was actually a big mistake of mine. Yeah, that actually might have just cost me the game. Because now, I don't know how I'm going to get two more energies on this alone. On the Raichu and alone on Raichu. Yeah, game. Nice. Well played. That was really, really good. That Lucario GX thrashed me. Nice, dude. Well played, Johnny Quest. Well played, my friend. Alright. Um, I'm sure I have an energy card that gives me more lighting energies. I want to say I have something like that. Uh, energies. Filters. Lightning. Do I have any special energies? Uh, aura energy. I get destroyed by the grass type decks. Yeah, I, I get that. Um, but hey, you will thrash Pika on, that's for sure. Memory. As long as this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides energy. When you attach this card from your hand to a Pokemon, draw two cards. So I can drop the speed energies in. I thought I had something to boost my electric, but I guess I don't. Um, what do I have that can boost my 
the play rate to my energies. Bede. Maybe better, but I don't really want to swap out too much. Um, oh, is it Electro Power that I'm thinking of? I think it's Electro Power that I'm thinking of. I've got the speed energies. I'm going to put the speed energies on now. I was just seeing if I had anything else. But I don't think I've got anything else that'll help. Um, no. It's just the speed energies. Yeah, it's just the speed energies. That's all right. Okay, let me drop those speed energies on quickly. Um, that'll just help a little bit more. Uh, let's edit the deck. Energies. One, two, three, four. And speed. One, two, three, four. Oh, four. Okay. All right, save. Uh, yes, that's fine. Let's jump into a game. Versus. Do you have a quest? I might have some electro power. Oh, if you do, let me know and let me know what you want. One for it and I'll send you the trade then. Well, send me the trade for what you want or let me know in the chat what you're looking for. Um, oh, I like those, those deck boxes. All right, let's see. Um, let's get this going. Okay, hopefully I can have a bit, a bit of a better game. Okay. Superior Sobble. How are you more superior than the standard Sobble? Okay, um, this is decent. I'm going first, which is not bad, I guess, with this hand. Let's get the Drachi down. Um, I would have liked to have gone second, but anyway. Okay. Uh, let's get that speed energy down. Cool. But, uh, let's go for Stella Wish. Eh, not really what I wanted there. Okay. Vitality band down just in case. Uh, I'm gonna quick ball. What do I want to quick ball? I want to quick ball away my uh, Pokemon communication to bring out Boltund. So I'm gonna drop Boltund. And let's just get the energy down on Boltund. Ugh, the Vitality Band down Boltund because reasons. And let's say I'm done. Hey, and Jirachi woke up. That's quite nice. Okay, so next turn I can go. Uh, Jirachi Stellar Wish Ability. Uh, energy down onto Boltund. Oh, no way. They're getting a knockout. They drew two Electro Powers. Ah, oh, man. That's frustrating. That is super frustrating. How do they have both Electro Powers in their hand? One of both, but how do they have two Electro Powers in their hand? That's so frustrating. Okay, well, I can go on a bolt on next turn and get Electrify off. Um, and then from there, Marnie. And hopefully get the Pikachu and Zekrom GX online. Or the Pikarom. Tired of saying the full name. Okay. Um, and hopefully Marnie gets me a decent hand. I can't believe I just got knocked out. Like, well played. That was a really, really good draw. Really, really good draw. Well played. Okay. There's Tapu Koko, which is quite good. Let's get that energy down there. Let's go and say hi with Marnie. Let's get a new hand. Yeah, it's decent, I guess. It's not great, but it's decent. Um, I don't want Poke here this turn because I can't use it. So nothing else I want to do here. So let's just go for Electrify. Let's get those two energies. Let's get them down on the Pikachu and Zekrom. So this is, this takes us 30 more damage for each Lightning energy attached to all of your Pokemon. So I currently have 3, 6, 9, 12. So I will get the Knockout. I guess I can get a Knockout next turn. If I put that energy down at Boltund. That won't be so bad. Um... But actually, we better just switch out into Pikirom, get the knockout with uh, the Blitz, and then I'll have a charged up uh, Pikirom, which I can then use Tag Bolt on the next turn. Yeah, I think that's a better plan. I think that's a much better plan. Ah, uh, they're going to charge up the bench, unfortunately. 
That's a tad frustrating, but that's all right too. Okay. Um, remove two energies from one of your tag Pokemon to another one of your Pokemon. Okay, so I could take them off of there and move them, but there's no reason to do that. Oh, wow, they got the top of Cock of E. Nice. Spike draw. Draw two cards and Thunderous uh, Bolt during next turn. This Pokemon can't attack. Eh, okay. So top of Coco is dropping. Charging up the... Those two? Yeah, tra charging up those two. It's a bit frustrating. Let's see. Um, hopefully I can get Pokegear off. Electros. Once during your turn before you attack, if this Pokemon is in your hand and you have at least four energy cards in play, uh, you may play this Pokemon onto your bench. If you do, move any number of energies from another Pokemon. Hover over. You defending Pokemon can't retreat during... This is actually not a great card. I must maybe actually move this out of this... Okay. Oh, I'm gonna get blitzed this turn. That's frustrating. Which means they're gonna come online before me. That is rather unfortunate. Where are those energies going? Because this Pokemon has at least two energies attached to it. In addition to the attack cost, this attack does 170 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Okay. Uh, let's see what I get from Pokegear. Got the Prof's Research, which is actually a good thing, because I can now switch, I can now get rid of this hand. So let's do that. Let's drop that energy there. I don't have any unlocked Electros. Oh, that's right, Johnny Quest. Um, I've, it, oh, I'll try and open one, but I'll probably do a trade with them very soon. I don't actually want a Poke here. I want to go for Prof's Research. Let's get a new hand. And this is looking better already. I can get another Jirachi down in case I need a Jirachi. I can get another Picarom down in case I need another Picarom. And do I want to switch or do I actually think I want those energies in my discard pile? So I'd rather actually retreat. And let's go into the Pikachu and Zekrom. And... I don't think there's anything else to do because I don't want to reset stamp because that just helps my opponent. So now let's go full blitz. Ooh. That is awkward. Um, I guess let's get them on Pikachu and Zekrom. Are the rest of my energies all... Oh wait, I can't bring speed energies with that. Yeah, I can't bring out any speed energies with it. Bless me, sorry about that. Okay. Um, I will be able to get my GX off next turn. But again, it really puts me in an awkward spot. Because I'm basically sitting in the position where... I'm basically in the position where if this Pikachu and Zekrom goes down, I'm in serious trouble. If I was on the bench... it's oh, a lot of damage. And then next turn they got Lightning Ride GX. Um... Mm, this is a problem. I need to draw another switch. But I... Oof. Um... I don't know what to do. Okay, wait. What I can do... Wait, me, I'm being stupid here. Let me switch. Switch into Jirachi. Yes, let me switch into Jirachi, play speed energy on Jirachi, top of Coco, the energy's there, there, and there, done, then I retreat back into that one, reset stamp I definitely don't want to do, ordinary rod, uh, I can bring back I actually don't want to bring back anything. I guess I'll just do that one. Um, and then let's go for Tag Bolt GX. And let's knock out their one in the back. Okay. But now the problem is, I don't have a plan B. I don't have a plan B. Um... Mm. 
Because the issue is they just knocked me out this turn. Well done. Thank you. I think you got to add bosses orders for late game situations. Yeah, that's a good idea. Because the thing is now... Now what do I do? I need to get Jirachi out. I need to rod those energies back into my hand. Uh, back into my deck, sorry. Let's bring that. And let's bring the two energies back into my deck. Um... I want to... Man, I want to reset stuff my opponent, but it does nothing because I'm about to Marnie them. So, let me Marnie first. Maybe I'll draw into a reset stamp. So, let me Marnie this way. Let's get a new hand. Eh, that's not great. It's not fantastic. Let's still a wish this. Um, ooh, Prof's Research. Prof's Research is looking good right now. Prof's research is looking very good right now. Um, the other option is I could do it this turn. I don't know if I'm going to get knocked out next turn. I can actually rotate and bike this turn. Let me rotate and bike this turn. Maybe I can draw into something else. Because um, I want an electromagnetic. And I'm going to drop the switches. drop that. I think I can't drop the energy because I need to charge up this. Okay, let's bring these in. The other option is this actual Raichu load on Raichu is also really, really good. Um, this just does more consistent damage and it's already in the right direction. It's only one energy off. Let me do that and let's rotate and bike this. Okay, I've got another energy, which means I can come in next turn. I've got the switches, and I can then reset stamp them. Okay, this is looking better. Um, unfortunately, I can't hit their bench. But this is a step in the right direction. Yeah, now I wish I had boss's orders, my word. Because now I can switch into, switch into Pikaram and get rid of their Alolan on the back. I think I've got this game. Unless they boss my bolt hunt. If they boss my bolt hunt, um, it's over. Okay, they're not going to be able to boss me. Okay, so what happens this turn? This turn they don't attack. I presume they're not attacking me. So I... Now my next turn, I can Jirachi. I switch my Jirachi for my Picarom. I've attached the energy to Picarom. Um, I then apply whatever energies I have from my deck onto the Alolan Raichus. Oh, in that process, I also reset up my opponent before I did the attack. Quick board has no value for me. So that's it. So yeah, I Jirachi, I reset stamp, I switch into Picarom. I attach the energy to Picarom. I do full blitz onto my opponent. 150 damage doesn't get the knockout, but I can draw out the energy I have. And I can start charging up the um, Alolan Raichus. Okay, so I'm not getting not going to Jirachi this turn, unfortunately. It's not the end of the world. My opponent's down on one prize card, which is going to be very awesome for the reset stamp, actually. So let's bring that out. Thankfully, I do have this energy on my hand. So let's drop that energy there. I do have the Mellows and Lanas, which is something nice. So let's reset stamp this. Bye bye hand. Okay. Got nothing else I want to do here. So let's just full blitz. We get that knockout. I got... I've got the two speed energies left. That's it. Yeah, that's it. So basically, I've just got this P uh, Pikachu and Zekrom to play with. What I can do is 
Uh, I can't get a knockout this turn though, which is still the problem. But what I can do is I've got the double switches with the Melolanas and the switch. So even if they bring in the Lord and Raichus, I will be able to get out of the Paralysis. So I've got that going for me. The Raichu is only going to be doing a max of 160 damage. So they'll need to get two attacks off the Tapu Koko, which they wouldn't be able to do because they're sticking around with Tapu, Tapu Koko. I'll be able to get uh, two attacks off. Hopefully no Marnie. Yes, hopefully no Marnie. Um, okay, this is actually good for me unless they can charge up this damage. They can't. Okay, that's game. Because I can Mellow and Lani and then Mellow and Lana and then switch. So Mellow Lana. Uh, let's just switch into Zapdos, switch back into Picarom, and full blitz. Well played. Thanks, Johnny Quest. Game. Uh, there's no cards. Yeah. That was that was actually a good game. That's my first win with Picarom, I think, actually. Which is quite cool. Hey, and I got an event ticket. Made it even better. Alright, that was really cool. I'm enjoying Picarom. I'm enjoying Picarom a lot. Um... Let's change it up. Let's play some Reshiram. Uh, I haven't actually edited this deck yet, so this is the standard Reshiram and Charizard GX deck um, that you buy. Um, so I haven't edited this whatsoever yet. So this is still a fresh deck. I need to sit around and play with it a little bit, just to edit it a few times. Um, do I want to go first with this deck? I th no, I think I still want to go second with this deck. Um, because I want to get the uh, Volcanion off, which I actually managed to get, which is huge. That's actually huge, being able to get Volcano off on the first turn. Uh, let's just get that down just in case. Okay. Um, and I got Energy Spin on my opening hand. This is really good. And Green's Explosion. Search your deck for up to two trainer cards, reveal them and put them into your hand, then shuffle your deck afterwards. Uh, I haven't actually edited this deck yet. I still need to edit it. Oh, that is such a beautiful card. I love that card art. That is such beautiful card art. Okay. Uh, let's get that down there. Let's energy spin this. One, two, three. Thank you for that. Let us get that energy down on Volcanion. Nothing else to do for now. Green's Exploration. Let's say hello. Let's bring out... What do I want? I definitely want Giant Hearth. And... I want... 100% I want Welder. Yeah, 100% I want Welder. I always want Welder. Okay. That player made discard a company hand. They do that player to search their deck up to two energy cards, reveals them, puts them into their hand. I'm worried they're actually going to Marnie on this turn. I'm really worried they're going to Marnie on this turn or something. Um. I don't want to play Giant Hearth this turn. I actually don't want to because I don't want to give them value. I'd rather lose it to Amani. Honestly, I'd rather lose it to Amani. So let's play start of this. And let's go and charge that up. Let's get one there just so I can retreat out. Let's get the other one there. All right. This Pokemon has at least three extra. So Flame Strike, I can't do it in the next turn, but I can use Outrage. I am really glad I didn't play Giant Hearth. I am really glad I didn't play Giant Hearth. Okay. And the, so... Double Blaze. If the Pokemon has at least three energies attached to it, this in addition this takes 100 more damage, and the attack's damage is affected by the effects of the opponent's active Pokemon. Okay, they profed. That's really good. Okay, they got the ADP out, which is a serious problem, though. Hmm. Pokemon has at least one extra water energy attached to it, which I think it does, yeah. Um, you get one more prize card. That is rather unfortunate. Um... I uh, just won't be able to get Weld off. Let's get rid of that. Let's switch out into um, Reshiram and Charizard. Let's get the energy down. Let's Welder. Uh, let's get those there. Let's charge this up. Uh, just can't get one more energy down, unfortunately. But I can drop that. And I can drop... Uh, I can drop reset stamp. Let's bring those two. These are my last two energies. That's a bit awkward. Um, nothing else to really do other than just attack. 
Yeah, it's time to just attack. Uh, I can actually attack all. Let's bring these two out. Um, I actually wouldn't mind a mellow. Let's do that. Yes, no play seven unless up to this. Yeah, yeah, no, I hundred percent agree with you. That's that'll definitely wrap play. Don't play it unless you have to. At least you can get and unless you can get value out of it. All right. Um, definitely gonna be using Green's exploration very, very soon. And let's just go for it. Let's go one, two, three. I just can't use double blaze yet, so I'm gonna go for flare strike. So let's do this. It's unfortunately not enough for a KO, which is worrying. Thankfully, I can Great Potion myself in the next turn. Um, I'm just thinking now, I might... I might want to heal up on this next turn. It depends what my opponent does. If they stay in... Because they don't get a knockout with this. I think I'd rather heal than use green on this next turn. Yeah, I think I'd rather heal up. Uh, but I can't... The thing is, I can't heal up too much because I need to get the damage off from... Um, Outrage. So I can't do too... I can't actually do too much with it. I must say, I really like this Mallow and Lana for heals. Really, really like it. Um, okay, let's see. Okay, they prop their hand away again. I need to get through this thing. I think I have to heal. So it, I'm going to be strong with 150 damage this next turn, right? My opponent has 50 HP left. So I need to have 20 damage counters left on me. I have to have tw yeah, I have to have 20 damage left on me. So I can use the Mallow and Lana this turn. But that means I have to get rid of Green's Exploration. I have to get rid of Welder. I think at this stage I can actually... Ooh, I could prof. I can get rid of prof. Right now, I think getting rid of Prof is actually one of the best things I can do. So let's Mellow and Lana this. Let's do both. Let's go... I'm gonna get rid of Prof. Oh, man. I'm gonna get rid of Welder, which sucks. I'm gonna get rid of Prof, I think. Because I can bring a Prof back with Queen's Exploration either way. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's go into there. Let's switch back into there. Oh, this is going to hit me next turn. The Trinity Burn. 210. Oh, that's going to get the knockout. Oh, that was silly of me. I didn't see this in the back with Trinity Burn. If I do this double blaze, I'm going to get knocked out. Oh, man. That was silly of me. I didn't see the Moltres Aptos and Octacuno on the back. That was so silly of me. Oh man, because even I heal up the two... Oh wait, I can, I can use Flare Strike. I can use Flare Strike because I switched out. What am I saying? I can use Flare Strike, so that's fine. This energy... I can, may as well use Giant Hearth to get rid of this one energy. I've got no energy left. Oh, I thought I had energy left in my deck. Okay. So let's Flare Strike this. Okay. We've got ourselves Poke Gear. We've got ourselves another Fire Energy. And uh, another Fire Energy. Okay. I don't think I get knocked out from this. It's dealing 210. It's doing 240 damage. So I'm not getting knocked out just yet. And you have attach five energy cards from your discard power to your Pokemon. And they can't use Sky Legends DX anyway. So I'm not getting knocked out this turn. But I'm gonna get knocked out next turn regardless. Um I'm gonna need to use greens. I'm going to have to use greens to bring me a 
Probably now, probably gonna need a welder or something. Okay, because I can use my GX tech this turn to knock out. Why are they charging that up? Am I missing something? What am I missing? I'm not missing anything, right? It's just game. Double blaze GX. Yes. Oh shit, it's not game. I forgot he has bonus HP. Oh sh shoot. Mm. I forgot it had, it had extra HP. Ooh, that was a big oof on my side. That was a very big oof on my side. Whoopsie daisy. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Um, I'm gonna quick ball because I basically wanna reduce the number of cards so that I can draw out I need a welder, and I need those two energies. I mainly just need the welder, because the rest I can get around. So, I now want to... I need the Pokegear welder. Oh my god, oh my word, I did it. So there's welder. Let's use this. Let's get rid of our lovely GX. Bring those two into my hand. Welder. Volcanion. They stored. Oh, that was a clutch win right there. <laughs> oh, that was a really bad play on my side, but thankfully my, I just top decked like an absolute machine right there. Whoo, okay. <laughs> Great game. Yeah, Johnny Quest, that was a bit of a roller coaster of a game. Um, wow, okay. That went really well. <laughs> I thought I messed that game up completely there, so I'm really glad I was able to come back from that. Uh, that was a bit scary. You can see I'm definitely new at standard. I'm not picking up on all these, what all these cards do. Oh, that is an amazing coin. Guasman, that is an awesome coin. Okay. Hmm. These Volcanians are coming out today. All right. Let's see. What do we have? What do we have? What do we have? Uh, Pokemon 2 cards in play have no effect. Eh, it's not the end of the world. Okay. Uh, yes, I'd like to draw a new card. Eh, well, Canyon, that's pretty cool. I can't complain. Rayquaza GX. When you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench during your turn, you discard the top three cards of your deck. If you do, you attach a basic energy card from your discard pile to this Pokemon. Discard your hand and draw 10 cards. That is awesome. Then Dragon Break. The stack is 30 damage times the amount of basic grass and light energies attached to your Pokemon. That is awesome. That is really, really awesome. Okay. Interesting, interesting. I like this. That is very interesting. Old school rare candies. I like it. Um. Okay. Alright, I see what you're doing now. Uh, put here this. Um, probably will get one another green. Rayquaza is awesome. Yeah, I've never seen it before. That's a really, really cool card. I like it. I like it a lot. So let's... Um, I don't want to go for the really cheeky, just like, crazy damage. Oh no, I can't get the crazy damage off. So let's Green's Exploration this. 
let's bring out the tag call and so I can't weld this turn so one items I want to tag call this and I think I want to I'm tempted to energy spin this I'm really tempted to energy spin this um they're honestly just switching honestly just being able to switch next turn I think is going to be the most valuable I don't want to commit an energy, another energy to this Volcanion. I really don't want to. Let's bring out my two Pokemon. Ugh, they're actually my only two. My other, one, my other rest from Charizard's a prize card. Okay. Let's bring these two beautiful cards out. Um, I definitely want to get this Brilliant Flare going first. So let's do that. Let's charge up Flare Starter. One, two, three. Let's get this going. One, two, three. It's not going to be a knockout. Oh wait, it actually will be a knockout. That's cool. Attach five basic energy cards from your discard power to your Pokemon any way you like. If this Pokemon has at least one extra energy attached to it, uh, your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned and confused. So I can use that at a later stage as well, which would be quite nice. Oh man, they minded my hand away. That's a bit frustrating. That is very frustrating because I needed that switch. Oh well, that happens. Can't get angry about that. Yeah, Tapococo, Tapococo. Okay, um, what do I need? What do I need? I need Poke Gear and hopefully get a good bunch of cards. What are they switching into? Oh, the other one. Ah, nice, Tempest GX, okay. So what does this a normal attack do? Dragon Break. This attack does 30 damage times the amount of basic energies attached to your Pokemon. So that can hit like an absolute truck. Okay, reset stamp, um... Yeah, I think I'm definitely going to reset stamp. Well, let me see what I get from Poke Gear first. Um, there's the Welder, which is great if I can draw an energy. Um, and Poke Gear again. There's the Green, which is really, really good. I don't really want to Welder this hand. I guess I can actually, I can actually prof this hand. Yeah, I'm actually going to prof this hand. I'm losing a Welder, which sucks, but. It is what it is. So let's get that Vitality Band down there. Let's... I may as well... Uh, I don't think there's anything left in my deck I want to get. There isn't anything left in my deck, so I can reset stamp this. Let's get rid of those. And then... Let's prof this hand. Alright, that's that's looking decent. That's looking decent. Um... And get this energy down. Um, I don't want to play Giant Hearth this turn. I kind of want to, but I don't. Um, I think we'll do that. And then I'm going to play a starter. And let's get... Touch to one of your Pokemon if you are second. Touch to one of your Pokemon. I can't put on this Volcano. Does the Volcano go down next turn? I presume Volcano goes down next turn because they're going to Dragon Break me. Three, six, three, six, nine. I have to play another energy and switch, which is definitely possible. I'm going to put it there just in case because I actually don't know if I'm going to draw another energy. Well, I guess I can. I could have Giant Heart actually. That was stupid. Okay. Um, let's see what happens next. Um, yeah, that Marnie actually kind of messed with me quite a bit. I know that's the point of Marnie, but still, it did mess with me. I guess I didn't actually really need to put that energy there, because I just, I could have mallowed. Yeah, I could have just mallowed. That's alright, it's not the end of the world. At least this next turn I can hopefully welder to get that next, uh, mushroom going. Yeah, there's the switch. So, Volcano goes down this next turn. Another money. Okay, that happens. Let's see. Uh, that's not terrible, actually. That's actually not terrible, in all honesty. Um, I'm I'm actually kind of okay with that. 
Yeah, I'm actually, I'm, I'm very okay with this, this new hand. Because, and there's Mellow and Lana, which is great for down the lines. Because I can energy spin. Let's say hello to you. Let's now welder. Let's say hello to you. I need to get in the habit of not using both for welder. Um, quick ball, I don't need to do anything else. Switch, I don't want to do anything this turn. So let's just brilliant flare. Okay, that picks up the knockout. Most certainly I want to switch my de search my deck. Um, I don't think I have... I've got two energies there. So I wouldn't mind the fire crystal. I'm probably going to need the great potion now. Uh, I wouldn't mind the giant hearth either. I think that puts me in a pretty good spot. Let's do those. Alright, and let's grab our cards. One. And two. Alright. What comes in next? I don't think that knocked me out this turn. I would like to think they don't. Um, I don't think they knocked me out this turn. Okay, what do I do next turn? I've got my other restaurant out, which is really, really good. Um, I shouldn't need it, because I can get another knockout this next turn with Brilliant Flare. And go through my deck for anything else I could need. Um, and I can go for the double switcher as well. To make sure that my Charizard and um, Braxton stay fresh. So they give themselves another fresh hand. Um, I like this idea of the deck. It's quite interesting. It's a very interesting deck. Are they going to be able to bring this Rayquaza online, or are they just sacrificing it? I feel like it's a bit of a sacrifice. Yeah, they yielded. I thought so. Alright. I'm actually doing pretty decent here with this deck. Uh, I don't even know what I'd even change. Nice. Okay. Hey, the 170. Perfect. I love when that happens. Okay, I think I'll open that up at the end of the stream. Uh, I'll probably stream for another, like, 15 minutes. So I might have one more game. Oh, okay, 171, it just wasn't perfect. Let's jump into one more game. Hopefully I can pick up one more win. And let's see how this goes. So I'm against a lightning water type deck, which is not ideal. This is now a slight problem as I'm playing into my weakness, which is not fun. Never fun. But let's see what happens. I must change this coin. I've actually got nice coins now, so I need to change this. Okay. I don't want to go first. And it's a mulligan. Thankfully, it's a double mulligan, but still. Okay, this this I can deal with. I can definitely deal with this. Um, so I was going to Char... Like, I'm so torn whether you're going to Charizard and Braxian first or second. Because, like, it's GX attack lets me bring back all those energies, which is huge. But at the same time, like... Oh, man, this is so frustrating. So frustrating. Um, let's just do that. This deck performs so much better going second. So, like, Bullion Flare is great because it's a setup. But Crimson Flame, Pillar GX is great because it gets those energies back. But I guess that's why you're running the Fire Crystal, so it's not as necessary. Um... That doesn't do anything, right? Does Electro Power proc even if the, the damage does zero if the attack does zero damage? No, I haven't actually played against the Chandelier deck. I heard about it. I do want to have a game against it though at some stage. Um to see what it's like. I think I've actually played against this deck before, the Nuzzle deck. Yeah, I've played against this deck before. No, I haven't actually played against the Chandelier deck yet. Have you had any success against it, Johnny Quest? That's such a frustrating deck. It's so annoying. Yeah. Like, I want to play... <laughs> it's one of the things, like, I want to play against it, but I really don't want to play against it. Um. Yeah, that's a bit awkward. Oh, man, there's Thunder Mountain. About 50-50. Okay, that's that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, it, that's, that's decent. Oh, man, this is a very frustrating deck. Okay, so it doesn't deal damage unless it would have dealt damage. That makes more sense. Um, this is not a great hand. I'm not super happy with this. Um, I 
Let's go for green. Uh, because I want to bring out my giant hearth. I want to bring out... I don't know what I want to bring out because I'm really sitting in a very awkward hand right now. Um... Uh, I don't know what I want. Um, I don't know what I want. Um, honestly, I think I want a prof for next turn. I know I'm losing Cynthia and Caitlyn, but I want a prof for next turn. Let's get rid of that. Let's giant hearth this. Uh, let's trash. Reset stamp. Bring out these two energies. Let's get one of those energies down, Abraxian. Alright, let's get that down. Yeah, I know. I can't let this deck get set up, which is why I'm trying to play super quick. But it's just kind of like not happening. Maybe I should have, I should have actually brought out a welder. I should have actually brought out welder rather than prof's research. Because I could have used the giant hearth and welded up the Braxian. Because I could have played an energy down on Volcanion, Giant Hearthed, switched. Uh, actually, I don't have to play energy there. I could have just Giant Hearthed Welder. That was actually silly. I should not have brought up Prof's research. Uh, Johnny Quest, the key is to let them draw themselves out and to only play one prize Pokemon. Oh, okay. I'll try and keep that in mind. So, the key is to let them draw themselves out and to only play one prize Pokemon. Okay. And Nelson deck, you can't let them set up. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to play quickly, but I've I just stuffed up there. I should have taken um, welder. I shouldn't have taken profs because I forgot. Like I didn't click. I'm so I'm still getting used to playing this type of deck um, with like bouncing of giant half. So 100 percent there. That was a mistake because I could have charged up fraction with welder and then got it in knockout. Because I need to start playing a lot faster now, a lot faster. I'm kind of tempted to not send out my Braxian just yet. I don't know. I need, I need to see what I draw. Um, because I'm tempted to just go with Volcanion. Because Volcanion knocks out all these Pokemon for now. And when they've got something that actually threatens me, then I switch out. I think I like that. I think I prefer that. There's their draws. There's their draws. I'm glad there's a boss's orders gone, at least. <sighs> this is wrong because I'm playing very slowly. Does the Charizard deck play Mellow and Lana? Yeah, it does. It runs, I think, two Mellow and Lanas. Okay. Okay, Vitality Band, I don't need here because I'm dealing 110 damage regardless. So I may as well put Vitality Band there. I'm going to play this energy on Volcanion. I'm going to Giant Hearth... Wait, why am I Giant Hearthing? I don't know why I'm Giant Hearthing. I'm, I should Giant Hearth after this. So I'm just going to say done because I don't want to lose those energies. I think I'm going to Prof. Sorry, that was a huge mistake there as well. Okay. Um, I don't have any more cards to bring, bring out with Quick Ball, so I don't want to play Tag War just yet, because in case I get rid of my hand. There's nothing else I want to do here. That was a big mistake on my side for Giant Hearth. So let's go for Fire Heat, High Heat Blast. And let's get Knockout. Okay. That was a mistake. Oh, man. That was definitely a mistake. <sighs> okay. Um... Thankfully, I can switch out, but I still need to get this Charizard and Braxian online. Okay. At least with green, I can I can bring out my... Um, what do you call it? Welder. Tingly return. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now paralyzed. Put this Pokemon all card attached to it into your hand. That's a bit irritating. Playing too slow. Yeah, you'll master these decks soon. Thanks, Johnny Quest. Um, yeah, that's also why I wanted to just sit and play standard today. 
was I want to just sit and practice these decks because like I know like I know I'm still learning and because that like I know I need practice so I just need to sit and I just need to work through them and I just need to play and play and play and play and play I just need I need to get in those games um I'm gonna bolt on VMAX me next turn I'm really irritated by the giant hearth play of mine. That was very frustrating. Okay. Um, so I can green this turn. Yeah, I'm going to be seeing it next turn. I got nothing left. They're down to 13 cards. I love playing against um, the like this Nuzlocke deck when I'm playing a mill deck. It's so much fun because they just do half your job for you. There's the boss's orders, which is very frustrating. They're going to boss's orders me next turn, which means I need to keep the switch available in my hand. Okay. I presume they paralyzed me this turn. So I don't really want to go out into... I don't really want to use my switch and go out into the Braxian. Uh, the Charizard and Braxian because... Something cool to think... Uh, okay, I'll read your message now. I just want to play this turn quickly. Um... Man, I wish I could Pokemon switch and Pokemon catch and knock out this Boltund. But I just can't. I wouldn't mind the damage on it though. Regardless, I wouldn't mind the damage. Let me see, can I get it? No, I don't get it regardless. Okay. Um, Green's Exploration. I need to get the Fire Crystal and I need to get Welder. For next turn. Um, I may as well play Giant Hearth this turn. Get rid of Quick Ball. There's nothing else in my deck I need. Let's bring these into my hand. Let's play that there. They're going to boss this order my Braxian. Mm. Oh man, they're, they're going to boss orders this next turn. There's nothing I can do about it. So I'm actually gonna put that energy there. There's nothing I can do about that. Ah, that's frustrating. That's very frustrating. Yeah, I'm gonna be losing this next turn. Uh, something cool to uh, something cool to do, I think, on your channel is check out the opposing deck after each game to see how other decks are built. That's actually not a bad idea because I know I never do that. Um. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. I'll take a look at this deck afterwards. And then just like review both decks. And it'll definitely help me learn and anyone watching hopefully learn as well and see how to play against it. That's a good idea. I like it, Johnny Quest. Thank you. I like that a lot. Okay. Um, how in the world am I going to win this game? This Bolt Storm is going to do so much damage. Because it's... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8, 16, 24, it's 240 damage. Doesn't knock out Char- Oh, they get one more energy down that knocks it out. Um, man, that's frustrating. Because they're going to boss this orders me regardless. But what I can do is I can then welder up my restaurant with GX and get the knockout there. Why? Why that one? Why that one? If they're gonna knock something out, why not knock out one that has energy attached to it? Why knock out the empty one? They didn't have an energy, they were short one energy. Oh, 
Oh, that is huge. Oh, that's a turning point because now I can go out into... Yeah, I can go into Rush from Charizard. I can play this energy. I can Giant Hearth. Uh, let's say goodbye Volcanion. Let's bring out these two. Uh, let's bring out Welder. Victory. Yeah, they saw it. Yeah, that was really cool. Okay. Uh, so let's see. Um, it's this one? MVPs. Yeah, definitely MVP there was Volcanion. That was really, really cool. Okay, let's see what they ran. Um, no surprise, they have four Emolgas. Picarusu is the top of Finny. Why are they on top of Finny? If your opponent has any Ultra Beast in play, this attack that can be useful just free. So it's just running if they go against Ultra Beast, you then run top of Finny. Okay, interesting. Uh, it runs the pick, uh, the Picarom for full Blitz, I presume. To get that going even faster. Top of Coco, the Dene is in the Bolton V. I don't know Bolt on V in this deck. Interesting. 36 trainers. Acrobikes. They got Thunder Mountain, which is quite cool. Oh, and for the fire weakness. Yeah, that's a good thing. Do they have... The deck doesn't run water energies, though. Yeah, the deck doesn't run doesn't run water energy. So unless... Unless your opponent has um, Ultra Beasts. And for water... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, I get you. Um... No, I, like, I got what you meant, but, like, you can, uh, my opponent, like, this deck doesn't run any water energies, so the only way they can get that attack off is if the opponent has, um, whatchamacallit, um, Ultra Beast in play. Uh, interesting, though, I like it. And then Trainers, uh, no big surprises there. Ah, oh, awesome Cynthia, man, awesome. Nice, I like it. Alright, so that's done. I think that's gonna be our last game for today, so let me open up that booster. Ah, oh, that was a nice one. That was a very nice one. All right, let's open up that booster. Let's see what we're playing this ladder for. Um, I'm not. I won't lie. I'm not too excited about it. But let's open it up and let's see what we get. Uh, let's see. We get ourselves. Never opened up any of these boosters before, so like I'm getting all of these as new cards. Uh, the artwork from the set is really nice. I like this art set. Very cutesy. Very cutesy. And... Oh, well, a Rocky Helmet. I mean, that's like, at least usable. I mean, it's not bad. It's not... Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's a nice... It's actually a nice Rocky Helmet as well. Alright. So, I think on this note, I think this is what we're going to call it. Um, thanks so much for watching, as always. Uh, Johnny Quest, thanks so much for participating in the chat and for coming off the stream. I really appreciate it and I always like chatting. Um, if you haven't, if you're watching this video and you haven't commented on the 500 subs video, please do so. It's a free giveaway, doesn't cost you anything, and you can hopefully get six boosters out of it. And as always, thank you so much for all the subs. I really appreciate it. Johnny Quest, have a great weekend. Have a great weekend, uh, my friend. Enjoy your Friday night or what's left of it. Um, thanks so much for watching, everyone. Cheers and enjoy.